Watch our secret location. And who I with two of the hot young stars currently shooting here, Kira Knightley and Orlando Bloom. Thank you for joining us for breakfast this morning. It's very nice. Pirates, breakfast. What would you think, Kira? Um, oh, good question. Um, rum. Yeah. A, a lot of rum. rum. A quarter of rum. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And probably not much else. You two seem to enjoy each other's companies very much. How nice is it to have the gang back together for these sequels? It's great. It's lovely, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, it's great. Well, we, we, all, we, we had a good time the first time around, and so yeah. we're back together, all of us. It's all the same faces, so, mm. you know, we all, we all know how we are at different times of the day, and we all get along with it. Exactly. Do you know there's certain rules, like, you know, if it's been a late, tough day, certain things you'll do vis-a-vis -vis our friend in the other chair? Well, I mean, obviously, he's the biggest diva ever, so <laughs> yeah. I just don't talk to him very much, yeah, exactly. you know, but apart from that, it's fine. Ten yards, ten yards. <laughs> exactly, kinky distance, and it's all right. The place <laughs> would be my judgment to make a character in this, in this movie because mm. of how onerous it can be in here. What added challenges does this place add for you? We've just come down this tiny little river, it's a mango river, and it's just... It's locations are often very difficult. It can prove to take, be very time consuming aside from anything else. And you're not just waiting, you're waiting in pretty intense heat. Yeah, I mean, it, it does make it difficult. And, you know, with stuff like leather jackets and you've got big boots on and all the rest of it. And by the end of the day, you can wring out the clothes. First movie, 300 million domestic. Big surprise to a lot of people. Now it's taken on a whole myth of its own. Why do you think the first movie, Orlando, was successful? I think, you know, it's sort of. It, it was such a family, such great family entertainment, and it was it was a smart movie for a family movie. And I think the writers have kind of done it again. They've they've come up with something bigger and better for the next two movies. Yeah. They had to sort of top the skeletal pirate thing, and I think they've really managed it with the uh, with the next two, haven't they? Yeah, don't give anything away. No, you got to give me a little something. I've been getting eaten by bugs today. Like I was, <laughs> I was what was on the menu. I'm I'm dressed as a boy. So that's something. <laughs> this is a costume slash maybe disguise. And maybe there's a little different action. For you, give me a little something about your character as it develops, what you think is cool. Um, Will kind of just, um, he comes of age a bit more, I suppose, in this movie. Obviously, the relationship between us, it's again, it's sort of like that. It gets really interesting. Yes. Shall we say? Yes. <laughs> and um, One of those words that says everything and nothing. Yeah, exactly. exactly. <laughs> Which is exactly what we're supposed to be being briefed to do. Yes. Tell them everything without saying anything at all. <laughs> you're not just doing one movie, you're doing two very big challenge other than the matrix and the lord of the rings series not a lot of people shoot two movies at once orlando give me a little perspective on what the extra challenge is when you're shooting two movies and there's like they're all out of sequence and you could be shooting a scene from the first movie in the morning and then they might plug something in from the third movie which is what they're beginning to do on this one they are yeah it starts to get a little bit confusing we're going to do a scene from pirates 3 either tomorrow or the next day and we hadn't read the script. I only got given, given the script for Pirates 3 yeah, last morning. night. Oh, yeah, it's so <laughs> exciting. But so I didn't know what, what scene I was coming back to shoot or what the storyline was or anything. And then it gets kind of a little bit scary. It's good though, but isn't it? It's, it is. It's great. exciting. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, no, yeah, yeah, it is. Sorry. You're doing it. <laughs> You're doing everything that yeah, yeah, I'm getting yeah, yeah. <laughs> Your boy Johnny plays his character, Jack Sparrow. He has said, ah, yeah, I was going for part Keith Richards and part Pepe Le Pew. Right. Well, I'm actually feeling rather good about this. I think we've all arrived at a very special place, eh? Oh, the Pepe Le Pew, did you pick up on that? You don't even know who Pepe Le Pew is, I'm showing my age. <laughs> Pepe Le Pew was this skunk who was oh, one yeah. of Bugs Bunny's oh, boys yes. who loved the ladies. Oh, I've never, the I've slap never of love. that before. Well, there we go. It's, yes, yes, you can see it. It's the genius of Johnny. Two last questions. Biggest challenge and thing you're most excited about? Biggest challenge, I have a sword fight with two swords, mm. which has been biggest challenge, but also the thing that I'm most excited about, because it's just, it's fantastic. So you're holding two? I've got two, mm. yeah, yeah. I was well impressed myself. Of course you were. Oh yes. <laughs> and you, sir? Um, I think fighting this kraken, there's a, there's a, there's a se sequence with a, a kraken, right. which is um, a, a big squid. Ah. Yeah. Um, and some nice. other things. Was that too much that information? That was too much. That was too much. You see, we were doing so well. Finally and got that's something. The inside, the inside of the beer. Yeah. <laughs> so what do you tell the people who are going to watch why they were, should be excited to watch this movie? Bigger and better. It's, yeah, exactly. Bigger, Bigger and, and better. Pirates of the Caribbean, Dead Man's Chest, is going to row into theaters in the summer of 2006. It's directed by Gore Verbinski, produced by Jerry Bruckheimer for Disney, the parent company of ABC News.